Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy John from John's Reptile Page, and it's, today is going to be a part two of my cleaning videos. I'm going to change the substrate. I'm going to wash the um, the jungle vines, the jungle plants. I'm going to take out um, champ rock from his terrarium. Because, like I said in my other video, the substrate that's in this tank is old. I would say it's like a year old or close to it. Um, and it's time for change because I guess, you know, all the droppings and urine that's already in that substrate, I could imagine how long it's been sitting there. And you can't like really wash it out or anything. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all that out, clean it up, dry everything inside the tank, and then apply new substrate. I have the substrate here. I have it sitting since yesterday, and um, let me get a, a better look at it, so you guys can see it better. It's been sitting in there since last night. I got it in this five pill bucket, five gallon, and you know, it's ready to go. It's been sitting in nice water. It came in a brick form, as everybody knows, and um, I just let it melt into the water so that's what I'm gonna do so that's ready to go so what I'm gonna do now I'm just gonna start taking a uh, champ rock out the tank so he doesn't interfere with getting in the way check him out look how beautiful this guy is look at him it's beautiful. I'm dying to see how he looks in the new substrate. How the tank is gonna look. So check it out. Look at him, he's just so small. I just was playing with my um, Beta Dragon tank. I cleaned that tank out. I cleaned everything, wiped everything down. Put his little um, rug piece in hot water, let it sit out in the sun, dried up, put it back in, washed everything out inside that tank. So handling that big dragon and handling him, he feels so small. Look. <laughs> he feels so smooth. Look, just look at him, look at his tail. He never dropped his tail, thank God, because I have one that dropped his tail and it's like, oof. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna get back to the cleaning. I'm gonna change the tank, wash everything out. And I'll be right back. All right, guys, I took out the fruit ledge, the jungle vine, the jungle plants, and the statue that comes with this terrarium. So I just wanted to show you before I dump this, um, this out here, the gravel. Look how nasty it looks. It looks discolored, has poop in there. So, you know, when it's like this, you know, it's time to change. I'm gonna get rid of this and definitely put in this. Look at the difference. Look at the color in that one, the fresh new one and the discolored one, <clears throat> like this one. See it? So, I'm gonna go dump this and then I'll be right back. Hey guys, I just soaked down the terrarium with hot water. I wiped everything down. Look how nice and clean it looks inside there. What a difference. So now I'm ready to put in the new substrate and uh, see how it looks. Hold on, let me go get the five gallon pail that I also have the substrate in. And I'm gonna put it in there so you guys can see how nice it's gonna look. All right guys, just bear with me. I'm about to put everything in there now. This is supposed to hold the humidity better than the other one that I had. Don't want to make a mess. 
I'm not gonna put too much, but um, just enough that it looks good. I'm rinsing out the water, so because I don't want to flood the bottom, fill it up with too much water, you know, because I don't want it to look all crazy. Just you know, nice and dry. The substrate is already wet. We've been soaking in water since last night. So it should be good. And I got a little bit more to go. Look how nice it looks. You can see the difference right away. It was about time to change the old substrate for the new one. Look how beautiful it looks. difference even smells fresh you know that fresh smell it smells a lot better look at that it's beautiful Let's see, should I put a little more nothing that's good enough let's see if I get a closer view for you guys look at the difference in color look how rich that looks just beautiful, man. Gorgeous. Look at that. Yeah, definitely put enough. See the thickness. Let me see, I don't know if you guys can see it. I don't want to put too much. But that's just about right. So guys, what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna go wash my hands and start putting everything together so I can show you how it looks with the finishing touches. Be right back. All right, guys, this is the finishing touches. I put the um, food ledge back. I put the statue back, the jungle vine. I put a little difference. You could climb up here on the top and just come down here and just eat off the ledge. I put everything back. The substrate smells good, looks good. Kind of nice that looks nice and neat. It was a big change for me. I like the way it looks. I hope you guys like the way it look. Look how everything looks nice and easy. Look how beautiful. Check that out. Look, at, look how beautiful it looks. Looks so nice. Just a little water and a big change. And now, without further ado, See if my boy here likes it. See if I could get him to go back in. He doesn't want to go back in. But let's see if he likes it. He's like, hey, wait a minute. Something's different. There he goes. He looks beautiful in there. Get a closer view. Yeah, he likes it. Look at that. Nice and clean. Guys, I got two more tanks to do. Like I said earlier, I did my Bearded Dragons tank. Now I did Champ Rock tank. And I got two more tanks to go. But, uh, yeah, man, I like the way this came out. Look at him. He just posing up there. Look at him. What I gotta do now is put the top back on. But look how different it looks. Man, look how different, just beautiful. Everything nice and clean. All right guys, if you like this video, please like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. If you wanna see upcoming more videos, and watch out for the other two tanks I gotta do. I'm going to definitely put that on video so you guys can see it. All right, guys, on this note, I'm out. Later.